Hi everybody, welcome to my channel today. Love you guys, thanks for coming on over and seeing what I'm doing today, craft wise. Um, I am not in my studio, I'm at my dining room table and it's just been one of those beautiful days where I've got the big window and it's bringing in lots of natural light as opposed to my craft room um, where my windows aren't in the sun at all. <laughs> and there's a little bit in the afternoon, but anyway, I just wanted to uh, come on here and I'm working on scrap busting and I'm doing a couple different books using that. This is one of them. This is gonna be an altered book kind of a thing and I'm doing some drawing in here and some watercolors and some doodling. And so yeah, this is kind of how it's coming up, coming together. And it's got some pictures in here and then I just wanna cover them up you know, I just don't want to, you like this one. I'm just going to want to cover these pictures up because I don't, they're, I'm not, it's a German book. I don't have anything understanding of this. I wish I did. Um, <laughs> it's just, I can't even, I don't even, I don't even want to even try to read it and massacre it. And those of you who do know German would be, would be really offended. Let's not do that. So anyway, pulled out some stuff. Um, got some graph paper. I like these blue things that I've got and this, I want to mess around with this. Um, this is um, an old Avery template for circle stickers that I watercolored on at some point. You can see, and some of them were, were plain, but I did some doodling on them. So that's what I'm going to do with these. I'm going to cover up the picture with a background and then doodle on a couple more of these. I have one, two, three, four, five, and then put those on the page. Because, uh, you know, to me, this is a big old piece of scrap right there. And this piece of graph paper that I've had forever, um, I don't know, you know, it's perfectly good. But I'm going to use this. Um, I have some, some of this colored paper. I have blue napkins. Um, yeah. So I think I'm just going to go with stuff that is blue on this page for whatever reason. Oh, and I brought out uh, my uh, Tombow water base dual brush pen. It's from this set, which is the Cottage Colors Cottage set, and it was a gift, so thank you for that. Um, you know who you are. And um, I'm just gonna start ripping and gluing and going to town.
letters. And how I'm gonna do that is take a piece of plastic. Oh yeah, that smush technique. Now with, I want some more pink on these too, so I'm gonna do the smush technique with the pink. are water soluble so you can see that my tulips are starting to bleed my little doodles are starting to bleed didn't think about that shoulda woulda coulda didn't but you know that's how we roll so I think maybe just add a few dots here looking thing. I <laughs> don't know if it is or not, but it's in my book and then my altered book. And I covered up one of the goofy pictures that was in it that didn't make any sense to me because I can't read the story. So that's it for this video. Love you guys. Thanks again for coming on over and seeing what I'm doing intrinsically and uh, what I'm pulling out and up my scraps today in this video. All right, guys, take care. And as always, God bless. Bye-bye.